And as part of the ongoing key resolve exercise, the South Korean Army carried out a drill on Tuesday to counter a simulated North Korean infiltration. The highlight was the deployment of South Korea's new Suryon helicopter. Oh Jung-hee reports. Immediately after the enemy is detected in the main facilities at the rear, four Suryon helicopters fly in formation. Suryon helicopters carry soldiers that have been standby to the operation area. As the Suryon gets closer to the enemy, soldiers courageously descend from the helicopter. Keeping an eye on each other, they decide where to attack and finally succeed in annihilating the enemy after a fierce battle. This is a drill involving mobile reserve forces held as part of the ongoing key resolve exercise between Korea and the U.S. It looks as real as actual warfare. Our special forces are maintaining a perfect readiness posture to preemptively respond to any provocation from the enemy and to sternly punish them. Mobile reserve forces refer to those that are dispatched as reinforcements or for a counterattack. They're led by Korea's utility helicopter Suryon, which was put into field units starting June 2015. The drill also involves refueling the helicopters, assuming that the battle goes longer than expected. Suryon helicopters are equipped with a variety of cutting-edge technologies, so it can operate anywhere. The refueling drill allows us to increase their flying distances and shorten our battle response time. Refueling takes only about 20 minutes, making for a much more efficient strike. Oh Jung-hee, Arirang News.